Hello, this is Griff from BossBarrel.com, and we are watching the attract screen of Einhander, the square, uh, soft, side-scrolling shoot 'em up game uh, that is beloved and awesome. Uh, let's see if this. I'm gonna back out of here. So. Kind of a little-known game back for the PlayStation 1. came out in 1998 uh, in the United States. And uh, like I said, it is a left-right-ly shmup. Um, let's see if we can let it sit to get the... Uh, well, whatever. Start the game, it's on normal. Um, might note that uh, this is a Square game, not an RPG. Kind of crazy. Um... But uh, it's on normal. I don't know if I mentioned that. Uh, and then we can pick our fighter that we want. So we've got a uh, special steam powered fighter. Uses two gun pods simultaneously. Equip both gun pods differently for a myriad of fighting techniques. Techniques. Lead fighter with a loadable spare gun pod. Can instantly adapt. Okay, yeah. So it's got this little arm that it can use to shoot stuff. Uh, it cannot load spare gun pods. So, basically, you've got three different uh, uh, difficulties here, where you can choose both weapons you want, uh, one weapon you want, and uh, no weapons. So, we'll go with the middle one, since it's default. Oh, yeah. So, man mandatory machine gun and empty bottom slot so here we go starting it up Einhander um, I can tell you I've never been good at this game uh, I do own it because I really like it but uh, I'm not good at it um, so we're now going to steal his falcon cannon oh yeah Tearing it up, mm-hmm. Okay, and then we can rotate it for a different angle on our attacks if we want. Get the spreader. So, you know. Oh, I got it backwards. Ugh. How do I? Okay, there we go. Just, so we can manipulate it. <laughs> want that cannon. Oh, yeah. Watch out now. So uh, it's not just 2D, it's this weird, like, 2.5D. Uh, watch out for these signs. Uh, uh, so, believe it or not, this game does have a story. Um, oh yeah, t take that. Uh, you were a super ship that was on the moon, and now you're coming back to Earth for revenge or something. Typical crazy nonsense, like anime style nonsense. Um, wish the uh, beginning movie played. I could get that to play, but. Alas. Oh, okay. We got a little boss fight here. Okay, what now? Shoot you in the face. Oh, my heat seeking missiles. Enemy seeking missiles. So as you can see, you can take a couple hits. Yeah. Uh, maybe. Actually, I don't know. One fighter left. Great. Okay. Take your cannon, guy. Uh, music in this game is kind of fun techno pop stuff. Is uh, Kenichiro Fukui. Uh, you know, so might recognize him from the Black Mages. Uh, somewhat famous Square uh, composer. But, I don't know, I like it. I'm no good at shoot 'em ups, obviously. Uh, it's extra hard to talk and try and do this. Oh, jeez. I took that right in, right in the fighter. Oh. So. When you change the difficulty, the only thing that changes it is just the amount of restarts you get, which is kind of diff 
crappy. I mean, if you're not a really good shoot 'em up player, there's no real way to see the end of this game. Um, ah! Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Um, maybe I should pick the easier ship that... Ah. you think about that? That lets me take two of those guys. That's pretty good. That way I can keep cannon. Oh, gosh. I think I got hit there. Ah! Yep. So, um, that's me playing Iron Hander, and, uh, that's pretty bad, right? So, let's not continue. I uh, know. Oh. Uh, pretty interesting for a Japanese game from 1998 to have, uh, X as yes, honestly. Uh, localization. Whoa. Localization. There was a time in the era of great chaos when the Earth and the Moon were at war with each other. Sounds like great chaos. A daredevil from the moon piloted a bizarre aircraft. From the moon. It was feared, and because of its shape, called Ironhide. But I barely knew her. That guy. My rival, stupid police robot. Cops can take you down. Earth cops. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Right, I got back out of this. Which I don't think I remember. Great. This. I'm gonna pick the easiest one. Because I'm not good at this game, obviously. I'm gonna choose what I load out with here. Sp spread gun here. Start with a little spreader. And, uh. What do you think? <laughs> Start with, uh. Vulcan cannon. Heavy machine gun. Alright. I should have switched it to easy so he gets more continues. So, now the only bad thing about this setup is you, know, you don't get um, just your basic shot. So you're always using special weapons here. Which, if you're careful, ends up working out pretty well. Ah, start on the outside first. I'll shoot you. Oh, jeez. I'm the worst. What is this even? I don't even know what's happening. Man, this, this is why I'm not good at shoot 'em ups. There's so much on the screen. My poor brain does not work like this. Uh. What do I want to replace? What do I want to think fast? Ah! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Yeah, watch out for the signs. Ah. Yeah, moon spaceship. So I, up until today, I didn't even notice there was a story associated with this game. I thought it was just like, yeah, that's uh, a game. So enjoy. Oh no! I wanted to keep that. Oh, well. we good here. Ah! Get the wasp on the bottom. Get out of here. I want that Vulcan cannon for my bottom. You know what I mean. Oh, that was bad. I think we're going. Oh, okay. Well, I'm boned now. Here we go. In the face. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Wow. Sigh. Um. Oh jeez. I need that on the top. I think that there was one one time 
I think I beat this level. This is pretty awesome. Like, it was probably the best day of my life. This isn't even, this is just mid-boss. I think there's a train or something I thought about here. I don't even know if I, oh jeez, oh. I'm gonna be quiet and just, ugh. Try and fight this guy. Ugh. Ah, uh, what am I so bad? I don't know, man. I... Well, this is going to be a great, uh, this whole game of Einhander, uh, of just the first stage, because I'm not going to be able to get any further. Uh, there's also no multiplayer. In the era of... Um... Uh oh. Uh, there's no multiplayer. Wait, did that say? Oh, that's it. oh I did it again. Ugh. Alright, well, let's try the three. So, set. Wait. It says there's three gun. I don't even. I don't even know, honestly, how to play this the right way, I guess. There's three gun pods. This way, machine guns. One. I get a machine gun? Two gun pods, three gun pods, one gun pod, two machine guns. Maybe I'm, I'm doing this wrong. I'm gonna start with, uh, I'm a fan of, uh, select to fire either concentrated rocket salva or tracer missile. Destroy heavy armor and pierce light armor. Wipes out anything in front or diagonally below it. Fans in the wide area hits multiple foes simultaneously. Uh, I'm a fan of the cannon, personally. So, according to that loadout, I should have, what, two other slots? But, uh, I don't know how to access those, so. Ah, look at that. Well, shoot. Look at it. Jeez. Alright, that's great. Good job, Greg. Okay, right, come here. Hit you. Fight you. Alright. Ha 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 ha. All Ah. Got you. Spread gun. Everybody loves a spread gun. I don't know if these dudes actually make an attempt to shoot at me. I mean, I'll get shot at plenty when the time comes. I'm not trying to front or whatever. Take that signs. Get my score. Boost my score. Shoot some signs. I don't, I don't want you. I do want Canada. Yeah, Canada. Ah! Get out of here. Oh, so many things. Vulcan. Heavy. I like Metal Slug, right? What about it? Police brutality! Oh. Great. So obviously my success in finding that I can switch multiple slots for weapons has not saved me or made that last fight any easier. Should I grab this? Oh, whoops. Oh. oh, I keep getting shot. Ugh. So it would appear I can take three ish shots. Uh, 
Yeah. Get you in the face. Oh, jeez. What is that? Uh, oh, God. Oh. All right, well. Hey, that's progress, right? Just lay on the cannon. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. oh. oh, gosh. Just get lit up there. Uh, I I am not a shmup purist dude that's like if you can't beat it on a one quarter clear then it's not didn't really beat it me I have good hand eye coordination oh, ah! yeah yeah what now German cop robot Spaceship. All right, now I got another half a level here. Great. So, 16 minutes in. Got it. Arch. Ah. Ugh. Focus. I like that instead. Oh, that's great. Okay, so I don't need to be constantly worried about. It having the right thing equipped. Whoa, what are you? Right, well, uh, how did I, uh, that's how I switched it. Uh. Yeah, take that. Stupid dish robot. Saucer, saucer bot. Okay, here we go. This is, this is where it gets good. This is where I do really well. These cops are following me. Oh no, hold back. Oh yes, angry frog robot claw lizard thing. I beat this once, I think. Just pour it on, I guess. I just pooped out my guy. That deal, I mean, I know that really good shmup players say you want to stay in the middle of the screen. That way you have more maneuverability both front, back, sideways. If you're not just... You're supposed to... Oh, jeez. Just the most minute movements, but I'm no good. I'm... Uh, what am I supposed to be shooting here? Ha! Ah! Ha! Ah! Yeah! Oh, jeez! Get out of there! Da 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 da! Telegram from Conduct Satellite Hyperion. Order the following operation. The armored trains were discovered leaving the city on their way to the east. Pursue them and locate and the enemy supply game. route. Ah, great! I'm gonna upload that. Uh oh, sweet. No break, right into it. I don't know. Is this like the true? Bo oh, I remember going through tunnels and getting rocked pretty. Whoa! Look at that upper mobility on there. Jeez, that's a lot of screen to maneuver through. These guys. Uh. Oh, jeez. Huh? Cannon? Ugh, I missed it. Oh, somebody's shooting at me, I think. Oh, great. Here's the fight the train level. I don't understand why train bosses are such a problem. I mean, right? You could just shoot the tracks. You know where they're going. 
mean, I guess unless you want to like not demolish everything that's on. Oh, I just ate that one hard. Yep. That. Cano. Wah. So it appears that like my weapons can also take damage. I can get shot in the gun. That must protect me to some extent. Ah, fly away. I think this is the best I've ever done in this game. So, I don't know, I mean, if you're not a fan of shmups, shoot 'em up games, or bullet heck. Uh, I don't know, this is definitely not a bullet hell shooter, but it's, oh, 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 so many things on the screen, I'm losing it, oh, I lost my weapon, stupid frog robot, um, I don't know, this is definitely not a game to go out and purchase, I mean, it is a collector's item, it, it, uh, it's worth around forty dollars at the moment. Whoa. Um, but uh, it's definitely a cool piece to you know know about or have because you know, Square Enix making a sh shoot 'em up game versus you know going out of their comfort zone, not doing the uh, RPG. So um, kind of unique, but. Uh, Definitely not fantastic. Good, good music. Uh, oh, but definitely not a forgiving game. No, no two-player. It's kind of a bummer. So, I think really I'm just gonna be beating my head against this uh, the longer I play, and it's not, not gonna be the most interesting thing to watch. And. Uh, I'm going to leave it at that, and uh, thanks for watching this old game. It's been Einhander for the PlayStation 1. Uh, it's Griffin Hoffman from, Bo Griffin Hoffman from BossBarrel.com. Thanking you, and uh, see you another time. Oh, I'm in the train. Okay. Bye.